Spot the difference. So yeah, it's uh, time to uh, review the uh, the Soundpeats Q9A guys. And as you can see, there's pretty much no difference between it and the Q9. Now the Q9, obviously, I did the unboxing on that and the review, and you know it comes out really, really good. You know it's got a, a red flat cable. The Q9A, however, is all in black. It's a nice sort of stealthy black colour. The the casing is actually. I'm trying to sort of distinguish between the two bits of plastic, and it's it's pretty much the same. Uh, I think there's a. I think there is a slight change in it. It's a lovely, I mean, it's a lovely feeling plastic. There's absolutely nothing wrong with it at all. And the other difference is they've changed the um, the colours inside the ear tips there. You can see that was your uh, the Q9 with the red stripe on. You can see it's got a red ear tip along with the red cable and everything. Whereas this one's gone with a green ear tip, which, you know, I mean, it's just a colour, isn't it, at the end of the day. Now, the other added bonus is you get the case that you got from the last one, really nice, but you also get a hard case with all your little bits and pieces in there. So that is really nice touch. Lovely that they throw that in. And the price hasn't changed either, guys. At the time of recording, these are still, uh, they're only about £15, I think, on Amazon UK. But, uh, you know, I mean, they're pretty much similar. There's, you know, the outside design just has not changed at all. Uh, other than, you know, they've, they've made the, the logo much smaller now. Can't get that to focus. Yeah, it's a much smaller logo on there and they've done away with the, uh, the coloured splash. Now, where the coloured splash was, there was also like a, that coloured splash wasn't just paint. It is actually an embedded piece of plastic and there is actually a ridge in there so that's going to be like your your main change in the case that instead of having that extra part in there it is now just has a one-piece plastic case so let's just uh, put those over there again and everything functions exactly the same so you still got your power on in the middle and these ones double up as track skip um, and uh, volume of course depending on how long you hold them uh, you still got uh, the charging location still in the same place right on the bottom there just that little rubber flap just in there so nothing's changed music however I feel there's a slight change in it now some people might say different but I believe there's actually a slight change and I think the uh, the seem to sound much richer the the it picks up the more subtle bass um, which the other ones they don't seem to quite as much they pick up the heavier stuff but not the subtle ones as much but if I just uh, put that on it gives you give you a look at uh, what it looks like in you know it's all it's all very nice flexible and if I come up now and you can see what that looks like so you know really nice look with that uh, sort of stealthy sort of look to it staying perfectly extremely comfortable zero problem with them whatsoever and like I say I believe they actually sound a bit better as well and at 15 pound a pair you know you just absolutely ideal you know this time of year you know if you're struggling for a little uh, Christmas present for anybody definitely definitely go and check these out so they're the sound peats Q9A I'll leave all the links below for Amazon and uh, yeah definitely go and check them out guys nice Christmas present for somebody all right, big thank you to Sound Peaks for sending them out for review, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers, guys. See you.